Microsoft released new KB505-8379 update OS build 19045.5854 for Windows 10 version to 2H2. This is part of the May 2025 patch Tuesday update. Bring important security patches to keep systems secure and stable. Today's update also fixes a GPU per virtualization issue in WSL2 updates the Windows kernel vulnerable driver block list for view of the tax and resolves sgrmbroker.x errors in the event viewer. This is an important update download and install automatically or go to settings update and security Windows update and click check for updates to manually install it. You need reboot your device to apply changes. As per official release note, this update refreshed the Windows kernel vulnerable driver block list, which now blocks more drivers used in bring your own vulnerable driver attacks. This helps prevent attackers from using flawed third-party drivers to gain elevated privileges, strength overall system security. For developers, especially those working with the Windows subsystem for Linux 2, WSL 2, this update delivers a crucial fix. A case sensitivity issue in GPU per virtualization checks had been interfering with GPU support in WSL2 environments. It also addresses a persistent system error related to the System Guard Runtime Monitor Broker, SGRMBroker.x. Since January 2025, this service had been causing event viewer to log frequent event ID7023 messages, cluttering system logs and increasing administrative overhead. This update also focuses reinforcing internal window security. Although Microsoft has not detailed these changes publicly, the update includes miscellaneous security improvements designed to protect against emerging threats. However, there is one known compatibility issue that enterprise environments should be aware of. Devices running Citrix Session Recording Agent, SRA, version 2411 may encounter installation failures during the reboot phase of this update. Once the update download and installed, reboot your PC to apply changes. Now you can run Winver command to check it's upgraded to latest Windows 10 version. Also, you can visit Microsoft Update Catalog to download the offline installer file and install the update manually. It's useful if Windows Update is stuck fails to install an update. Visit the Microsoft Update Catalog website and search the KB number. Look for the version that matches your Windows edition and system type. Click the Download button next to the correct entry. To check your system configuration details, open Settings click on System then About. Here you will get your system and operating system information. For example, I have 64-bit OS installed. So download the offline installer accordingly. Once complete, run the installer and restart your PC when prompted to apply changes.